Hello guys, like I promised you, today I want to make video about Bulawaya Animal Rescue Center. Yesterday I had discussion at Deja Vu with Claire, who is organizer, who is owner of this Animal Rescue Center, but she is busy. And today we take round together with Solomon, because he's in charge, he's looking after animals. Can you explain, Solomon, please, for us, how many animals do you have? We've got 50 donkeys and nine big horses, uh, five miniatures. Okay. Yeah. And you said you have how many peacocks? We've got 14 of them. You can see yeah. noise, yeah? <laughs> We've got 14 uh, You peacocks, see, yeah. he understood that we are talking about him, you know, beautiful, <laughs> white color, white color. Yeah. Where did you take peacocks? Uh, uh, met him, uh, they were staying in Metem South, then he brought them here. I don't know exactly where he found them. Okay, but, but what about explain for people about. Uh, we are keeping them here. Here. Their and separate, yeah. yeah. Okay. Explain people about donkey. Why they are coming? Like you explain mostly of people, they can't look after uh, yeah, we look donkey. Af we look after them because uh, the owners are not able to look after them. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They beat them and they've got mm -hmm. wounds. Okay. So yeah, you sometimes, you, the you, sometimes you take from street. Yeah? Some of them, mm -hmm. they just leave them walking around on the road, so they might be beaten by cars and other things. Yeah, yeah, so we yeah. collect them and bring them here. Yeah. Who is treated this? If, for example, you got a uh, donkey with serious wounds or with a broken leg, who is doctor? Who is looking after it? Uh, you take to vet surgery or somebody yes. is coming? Madam looks after them and mm -hmm. at times he take them to the surgery. Mm -hmm. He buys some medicine, come and treat them here. Mm -hmm. Those that he can, she can treat, she does. Those that she if, cannot, if, if she any take problem them to, anything to else, the yeah, yeah. yeah. Because I made video here at 2019, beginning of 2019. It was small, really yeah. place. Yeah. Now it's big place, yeah? Yeah, yeah. I see you did renovation, yeah? Mm -hmm. And now yeah. it's really big place. You can see the animal not around now, yeah. you see. Let's go to show for people, okay? Yeah. At least you can see everything is empty, yeah? yeah? How many number of staff you have who are cleaning uh, everything here? Uh, we are 12 of us. 12, okay. You are yeah. in charge and 12 of you. Yes. You are coming every morning to this place and you are cleaning only morning or evening the same? I stay here. I stay evening. here yeah. in cottage, yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Some of everyone goes to their places. Yeah, but you stay. are here with family and you are looking 24 hours, yeah? Yes. 24 hours, yeah. you see. Now, how many you have separate set for, for 50? Uh, this side, uh -huh. you are keeping the horses. Like cage, yeah. yeah. Uh, this one, one, in each. one side for horses and one side and for the other side. We've got donkeys. Mm -hmm. At times, there are some who stays two in each stable, mm -hmm. others stay one in each, mm -hmm. depending on which on if they like each other. Yeah, so yeah, if they like it's correct, yeah. Put them, uh, together when they don't like each other, yeah, yeah, so yeah, we have to separate them. Yeah, 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 it's very important. Yeah, let's go. I saw some dogs. How many dogs do you have? With four dogs. Four dogs. I remember I made video at the beginning of 2019. You had the same dogs and they still here, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Where sleeping. did you take dogs like this one? It's rich back, I see. Sleeping. Yeah, How are you, my dear? Sleeping, deeply sleeping, yeah. Okay. So we, mm -hmm. we have them like. For protection they, or just the same? You are looking no, after? They, they came. Mm -hmm. To us, so then we look up. We look up. Looks like uh, some of uh, owners they left dogs. Yeah, so you collected these dogs stay, from street. Yeah, some of them were street dogs. So mm -hmm. they came here. Then we started to look after them. Started then to look after. Cutting our place. You see, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And now they're as I say, good security. Yeah, Sorry. good security. Good Se security for yeah, you. Yeah, you are not security. afraid. No, so don't scare at night. Uh, no, no. no. They are here. Because let's go show for me all animals outside. Usually, yeah. when do you take animals outside? Animal, Time, eight o'clock or? Uh, we bring the animals here at half past one. Half past one. Then they are start, coming back. They are coming back. Yeah. yeah? Then we start uh, brushing them, uh, check if they are, mm -hmm. they are all right. No wounds. Yeah, yeah, and, yeah. Uh, everyone is. Okay, no sickness or whatever. Okay, let's go to show for me. I see some of them outside from Most left of side. Them are going to the paddocks, but here we've got the blind ones and mm -hmm. some which we castrated. So which can't go so far, yeah? Like yeah. blind one or physically not well, yeah? Yeah. They are here, mm -hmm. but um, healthy one you take somewhere separate, yeah? Yeah. Okay, let's go to show for me this one. 
Mostly of I can see here it's donkey, yeah? Yeah. You can see dogs. They like to be outside, yeah? The we are behind of... Yeah. yeah, okay. Here place for small one donkey, yeah? This side is... From this side, it looks like small. These ones are blind, so mm -hmm. we, we keep them inside so that mm -hmm. they don't go in the bush, they will hit against the yeah, trees. Yeah, like yeah, 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 yeah. So where, where do you keep small one? When, where do you have nursery for small one donkey? Small donkeys? Yeah. Uh, they are here? Or? Yeah. Some are here. Some of here. Some of them, yeah. yeah. It's nice, nice, yeah. So we separate them from males. So these are female donkeys with their babies. This female and small one, like nursery for female yeah. and, and for small she's one. Pregnant, okay, one of pregnant, yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, and another one somewhere yeah, further, somewhere. yeah. On that other side. But do you have people who is coming and say it? Because before Claire explained for me, let's go to show another. Uh, some of people they want to keep donkey, yeah? And they are coming to your place and ask. Uh, for example, can I take donkey and keep in my house? Do you have this group of people? Because I suggest, do you teach these people, yeah, how to look after donkey? Yes, it's going to be a special should. program, yeah? When, they, when you bring them here, we tell them exactly what they should do with mm -hmm. their donkeys. Yeah. So that, uh, Let's go they inside. Keep them as good as keep them. Because um, Claire explained for me, you have special program, yeah? You have special program for people who are interesting, you know, uh, to take donkey because they must know how to feed, how to look after. Yeah. Yes. So, ah. also. <laughs> this one, this is one of the castrated ones. The castrated seven male donkeys. Okay. So now we are keeping them here mm -hmm. so that they can heal up. Yeah. She then... was injured before. Uh, no. Yeah. She was, she was lame when he came here. Ah, now shame. It's now right. it's getting bad. <laughs> Very interesting. You see, they are playing <laughs> in soil, you know. <laughs> yeah. Oh, here, so. male or female here? Yeah, no? these are, are male. Male, yeah. A blind one. Ah, blind one. So that's why we keep them uh, mm -hmm. here. We don't want them to go out and Yeah, then... because it's going to be trouble. Why yeah. they are blind? Because of age or they were injured or wounded? They were injured, maybe at times. Those who owned them before, they were beating them, maybe they ah, put the shame, eyes, eyes into ah, the... shame, shame. But shame. we don't really know exactly what happened. What, what happened here? Yeah, we we'll yeah. just think that that what yeah. happened. It's how many four of them they are blind, One, yeah? Two, three, four, yeah. Four blind. Yeah, and that two. two six, yeah? Yeah. Six they are blind. Another one I see somewhere in the bush. You see, yeah. you put. Mm -hmm. uh, that one is the room mm -hmm. which was closing his eye. Uh -huh. So they cut that thing away. Now the wound is healing now. Yeah, two of them. They came with, uh, they came injured, yeah, and now yeah. they're still under treatment, looks yes. like, yeah. This one, uh, I think, was beaten by a car. Ah, oh, shame, by a car. Ah, oh, shame. The teeth were, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. were taken out. And I some of people brought, yeah. Yes. For, you see. So we put grass outside and mm -hmm. water, I think, mm -hmm, as you mm -hmm. see. Yeah, yeah, you put, yeah, at least, and food, you see, they have everything, they have mm. food, yeah. yeah, 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 looking, especially, you see that one looking exhausted, you know, yeah. looking not well, these two not too bad, yes. but that one is looking, water is here, yeah. especially with drought uh, time, now drought in Zimbabwe, mm. not water, no, not water food for grass. donkey, at least, but you are looking yeah. very properly. Yes. And uh, like a program, usually you are coming very early, yeah, yeah. six o'clock, yeah. Yes. You are feeding all animals, yeah. yeah exactly. Okay. And they are going out. You put everyone you out. Put yeah? everyone out. Take the horses to the mm -hmm. paddock and separate the donkeys. Mm -hmm. the Donkey separate, ones, yeah, yeah, yeah. Horses separate. Everyone yeah. separate. Okay. And after that, we come clean the stables. Half, half past one. Half past one. Half past one. We go and collect them. Okay. Make sure they are all uh, mm -hmm. in good living. Mm -hmm. The eyes are clean to see, to see that yeah, no one yeah. is, is put a, in problem any problem with physical. Eye. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we clean their hooves mm -hmm, mm -hmm. to see if there are stones stuck under the, mm -hmm, the hooves. Mm -hmm. Then start brushing them, taking the dead hair away. Mm -hmm, then mm -hmm. waiting for the other hair to to grow. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, yeah, mm. yeah, yeah. But small one, you don't have too many, but you are keeping exactly separate together with mom, yeah? Yeah, we keep them separate. with our moms without uh, males, because males can start running yeah, after, after yeah. the small ones, then yeah, they yeah, get yeah, injured. Yeah, yeah. Where is your horses? I don't see any horses. Ma- there's... Oh, they are, ah, they are they're so far, far yeah? Away, yeah. yeah, far away. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they are strong, they don't want to be here, uh, because they are physically no, strong, they want it, to it, run. That's where there is... Uh, grass at the moment. Okay. They started here, then mm-hmm. now we put them. That is the our last part of which is big enough so that they can walk around and yeah, yeah, and yeah, 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 yeah. To check up. Yeah. Very interesting. Very interesting. Yeah. What about <coughs> that one building? What is it? It's like uh that green one. What is it? Uh that's a a shade for for the horse box and the, this uh, scotch card. Uh-huh. Mm. That's where we put them. Sometimes okay. you put to that side, yes. yeah? Okay, yeah. yeah. You Both can see from... Those books is inside there. Mm-hmm. And that uh, sports card is there. Mm-hmm. So when the when you hear that there is a donkey which is supposed to be uh, taken from some place, mm-hmm. you just reach the horse box yeah, to go. Yeah, when go. When yeah. you come back, okay. put it there. Which one is youngest one, donkey? How old is your youngest one? One month, one year, how old? <laughs> uh, oh, but, uh, I think it's one and a half months. You see, it's very interesting. This one decided to go under shade. Yeah. You have yeah. something for flee, <laughs> you know. <laughs> yeah, this yeah is because too much, too much, yeah. Decided to go because maybe hot. Yeah. Decided to go under. Yeah. yeah. All of your member of staff, you are working at least you have salary, yeah? You have salary with you are working free or really you have salary at least you have money for surviving yeah yeah we are getting paid uh, not well done yeah at least you have something so which one is youngest one youngest one is that little one who is ah, sitting okay. with his mom his mom you see how old how how old it's one one month and three weeks ah. <laughs> yeah small one but you see stay together with mom doesn't want to go to anywhere yeah, yeah. and uh, this pond you organize for what pond i see pond this mm-hmm. uh, that's, uh, keep fish in here uh-huh uh, but we trap water from the from the roof uh, from this gutter mm-hmm. and mm-hmm. water goes underneath mm-hmm. then taking them there Mm-hmm. Then Do you take menace and fish and which are there. Oh, yeah. okay okay mm-hmm. let's go to that side because some of them walking at that side, yeah? Yeah. Uh, yourself, you organize everything for, or some of people try to bring for you? Help this, for, yeah. this, this is the leftover grass. Ah, yeah. So now yeah. we take this to make my new one. Well, you know what that is, you see, they tag it. Yeah. 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 Oh, it's beautiful peacock, you see, it's beautiful. Ah, you see, problem with ear, yeah, something it's happened. And these eyes. Is these eyes, ah, oh, my dear. Somebody cut, mm-hmm. what was happened? Yeah, at times they say, mm-hmm. they make this as a earmark so that they know my cutting is like this. Ah, shame, But they shame. cut too much. Too much, exactly, yeah. cut too much. It's all now, all now, yeah. Why? She came just the same. Somebody brought from street. Yes, Didi, yeah? Yes. Ah, shame. Mm. How are you, my dear? How are you? Is she Didi, yeah? Didi, yeah. She, yeah? She's completely yeah. Yeah, ah, shame. And you see problem with ear. Somebody yeah, cut, you know. They, do is they, they cut the ears to tag them. Mm-hmm, so mm-hmm. they'll cut, you'll see, all, most of them mm-hmm. have cut ears. Then if they steal them, they yeah. then cut that tag out and put their own tag in. And eventually, you'll see, we've got several with only like this one, one ear or no ears mm-hmm. um, yeah. because that's what they do to, ah, to shame, hide yeah. the, the, the tagging ah, and shame, that's shame. the cruel thing yeah, yeah. She, shame, she's completely blind she's a sweetheart but yeah. very sweetheart, yeah, very yes, good girl we've had looking for about what, six weeks now, hey? yeah, so. yeah but what was happened, why she's blind? that's again, you know we are not sure. know, but a lot, of, a lot of the blindness comes from the whips Ah, you know, they whip and they're not they looking properly. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, um, yeah. And like they're eating, really yeah, eating. Yeah, and, and and so that's generally what it generally, is. Generally, yeah, yeah. From is from the whipping. Mm-hmm, um, mm-hmm. And what they don't realize is, you know, whipping. You don't actually need to whip donkeys. They're very, very oh. intelligent. Yeah, yeah, and it, yeah. Uh, it's a, it's where the they've 
lost in translation. One could yeah, say. yeah, yeah. They used to use the whip as a directional thing. So you yeah. click on the right hand side and they turn left, click, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. so on. But now they they just whip them and yeah, they don't yeah. need to. Mm -hmm. And part of our education program when we go out to do the harnessing and that yeah, is mm -hmm. to try to teach them that they don't actually. People, to how to look after, yeah. how to look after, uh, yeah. You know, mm -hmm. that you can, I mean, you can actually, they're so clever that you can mm -hmm. actually just train them by voice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because stigma, donkey is not clever, yeah, stigma. Yeah, no, but they're very intelligent. Very intelligent, very, very, very intelligent, intelligent, yeah. Can you introduce yourself? Yeah, we can introduce Hi, you. I'm <laughs> Helen, and okay. I'm a volunteer, I help Claire. Oh, okay, the, yeah, okay, because sanctuary. I know everything about this <laughs> center, you know, how to look yeah, animals. No. How many years you are working in I've here? just been here just over a year. Okay, yeah, um, yeah. But I come from a farming background, so I Okay, really are you here it. from Bulawaya? Yeah? Yes, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It's so, very important if, you, for yeah. example, we have voluntary people who can yeah. come to help. Yeah. Sometimes not enough 12 members oh, of staff, no, you know. Yeah, yeah. And, and, you know, I mean, I'm retired now, so... Yeah, at least we are very interested here. Yeah. Yeah. And I, I have learned an awful lot, um, and I mm -hmm. go with Claire to all the... Um, the workshops and, yeah, and yeah. things like that. So. At least you can teach people how yeah. to understand condition of donkey, mm. how to look after, I mean, how we, to keep... We're, we're, what we're hoping to do is um, to expand now, we're hoping we'll be able to start going back out into the rural areas yeah, yeah, to expand yeah. our training program where we, we've we developed some harnesses um, mm -hmm, which mm -hmm. uh, are relatively cheap to make mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, but are kind to the donkeys, mm -hmm. you know, um, because the problem, most 90% of the injuries we see are from harnessing. Ah, shame. Yeah, shame. Um, and they're tied up with wire and they're yeah, ill-fitting. Yeah, yeah. You'll have one big donkey, one small donkey. Shame, yeah, the yoke yeah. is up under their necks because mm -hmm. the straps are not yeah, um, yeah. Uh, long enough. And then they also, they'll put four donkeys instead of just two donkeys. Yeah, yeah. And those two on the outside are tied in Just so they a, can't yeah, walk yeah. straight mm -hmm. and they're actually doing nothing because they're not nothing, pulling yeah. the, they, yeah, they don't yeah. take any of the load yeah, especially people they can't understand yeah and they they're also don't... you know they don't know how to harness properly so they harness it, them too close to the cart yeah and then yeah, that's yeah. where like that we have made on the bottom there probably mm -hmm, what mm -hmm. happened to her the one with the fall yeah but okay so mm -hmm. she's got a broken pelvis and broken oh, legs. Shame, and probably shame. what happened to her mm -hmm, was that mm -hmm. the cart went yeah. into her, an overloaded car shame, went into her and, shame, and shame, broke, shame, her, yeah, shame, broke yeah. her pelvis. Ah, oh, shame, um, yeah. <laughs> she but, eating. Yeah. Well, so yeah. having lunch now. She, she has the, lunch. The, the, old, the old girls yeah. get fed um, mm -hmm. three times a day, four times oh, well a day. Done, yeah, yeah. You know, people say to us, oh, they're so thin, but, you know, they just deserve to... to mm -hmm see their days out here where they I mean Hollyhock is completely blind yeah Mary yeah, is yeah. blind as well yeah too but many they, blind yeah they enjoy themselves and yeah you know they're well looked after and they don't have to worry about anything else. yeah I ask Solomon usually you are treated for example they are coming with wood they are coming injured who is looking as a doctor your, yourself or you call a vet well, doctor well we I mean we struggle with vets because mm -hmm. um, especially in Bulawayo yeah um, but in Bulawayo, too many vets, doctor. One of one of the few vets uh -huh. <laughs> died a few weeks ago from Who's cancer. Who's this one? Who's this one? Uh, Chris Rohde. I knew him. Wow, yeah, he passed he away. Had yeah. Cancer, so. But what about Robertson? Usually he helped you too yeah, much. Yeah, but you see, uh, Dr. Roberts is also semi-retired now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah so yeah, Jared yeah. Stevenage, who, who Stevenage, does help yeah, us, yeah, yeah. and Inga Boy helps us. Uh -huh. You know, they're very busy, and yeah, and yeah, that's. Yeah. It's, you know, the donkey, and, and also, you know, one of the things that we try to teach mm -hmm, the mm -hmm. locals is the value of their donkey. Because yeah, yeah. They don't yeah. value their donkeys because they're not cattle or goats or sheep which you can eat yeah, or sell. Yeah, 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 yeah. So they don't, they don't value them in the same way, which is why yeah. they don't look after them. Correct, yeah. So we try to teach them that, you know, this is their motor car. Yeah, 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 yeah. And if yeah. they look after it, they will have this motor car yeah, working for them. Problem. Because donkeys yeah. will live a long life. Yeah. They use only for hard job, for yeah. hard job, for car yeah. so, you know. And they, they will live, a, if you look after them, they will they will live mm -hmm. quite a long life. Yeah. Um, yeah. And be be productive in if they looked after properly and yeah, they're not yeah, yeah, abused. Yeah. Usually how long they are still alive? It's normal, um, normally. Well... I think if they were in in here yeah, in a good situation, mm -hmm. they could live to forty. Forty, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, mm -hmm. But obviously, mm -hmm. uh, when they 
are being abused um, out where there's, they're not looked after yeah, properly, so yeah, there's no yeah, water, yeah. there's no food for them, yeah. and stuff like that. Their life is this small one? Small yeah. one, yeah. So, so Bella was <laughs> born here. Who is this Bella? This, this little one? Bella was born Bella. here. Her mum is the. Hey, it's Ella looking ve there. very attractive girl, yeah? Hi, yeah? yeah. oh, yeah. nice. Hi, oh, nice. Is to have a baby. And Rosie? Yeah, Rosie's baby is due yeah. like any day now. And Bella. And so, that small one? Now, pumpkin. Pumpkin. <laughs> No mother. Pumpkin, very so good boy, very attractive abandoned. boy. Yeah. How old is he? Well, we think she's about four months old. Four months. We've you had see. Her two months. Pumpkin, so you're a beautiful boy. Yeah. Pumpkin, you're a beautiful boy. Um, <laughs> so she's yeah. So she's a lucky one because we yeah, found yeah. her and um, she's here now. Um, yeah. But yeah, they, uh, most a lot of them have very sad stories. I mean, Ella mm -hmm. was pregnant when she came, and she had oh, a snare shame. around her oh, leg and shame, yeah. a broken shoulder. Mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm, but mm -hmm. she and she could hardly walk. Mm -hmm. But now look at her. Yeah, um, yeah. We will give every donkey every opportunity. Exactly, yeah, exactly. Um, so, because mm -hmm. people mostly they don't know yeah. exactly about yeah. donkey. They're yeah. interesting maybe of horses, but not donkey. Donkeys. They believe they're stupid, you no, know, it's a stigma. You know, they're, and they're a very valuable mm -hmm. commodity worldwide. Yeah, yeah. Very yeah. abused commodity. Abused, abused and now, of course, yeah. one of the biggest issues we have is with the Chinese skin trade. Because oh. the Chinese have decided that the, the fat under the skin has got medicinal. Ooh, and try to kill. And well, basically, um, certainly in Africa, we uh, Claire managed to Terrible. shut down an abattoir before it was mm -hmm, given a mm -hmm. license here in mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um But there are abattoirs in Botswana and South mm -hmm, Africa. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Kenya have just shut down all the abattoirs there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but worldwide, it's a very big problem because mm -hmm. donkeys don't reproduce very well. They reproduce, but the fertility rate is 65%. Oh. <laughs> so, at the rate that the Chinese are demanding skins... Mm -hmm. They want to take only for baby, or does it matter? No, no, it doesn't matter. Does it matter? Doesn't matter. Wow, wow, wow. Um, at, that, at the rate they're doing it at, you know, donkeys will be extinct in the next 10 yeah, years, yeah, 15 yeah. years. Mm -hmm, yeah. um, so, there is a big campaign going on. Um, but you know, it's it's very sad that very they, sad, they very think, sad. Yeah, you know, they don't know. Mm -hmm. They seem to find. But is it, is it, is it government pro, is it government program or it's uh, privately they are doing Chinese people? No, I think it's. I think it, well, I don't know whether you don't it's. Know. The, yeah, you know, yeah. the the thing is, the the Chinese seem to kind of get their own way where they can um, exactly they mm -hmm. can say, well, we'll give you this if you let us do that. Yeah, 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 um, yeah, yeah. And and it's very sad. So. But like, they can destroy totally ecology of oh country. Yeah, mm -hmm. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. yeah. And I mean Claire managed to, to there were I can't remember three hundred and something donkeys mm -hmm. at that abattoir. We'd been buying up donkeys yeah, in yeah. the anticipation and they were in terrible conditions. She managed to um, save twenty four. Mm -hmm, of which we mm -hmm. found homes for most of them. The only one we kept was Lucy, who had a baby. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, so we try to rehome where we can, um, oh, but she forever homes where they'll never be used again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, the other thing that we also try to do is if we if we come across yeah. Salomon, thank you very much, thank you, my dear. If we come across donkeys with their owners that have got wounds and everything, yeah. <clears throat> what we'll do is we'll negotiate with the owner, we'll yeah. uplift the donkey, bring it here get it better then the owner must come and work with us for two yeah, weeks yeah, so yeah. he learns how to look after his donkeys yeah and he learns how to make the harnesses and yeah. how to hitch their donkeys properly yeah exactly that is yeah. The, you know that is such a crucial thing yeah and for yeah, us that's yeah. a, a massive educational program that we are mm -hmm, trying to mm -hmm. um yeah. expand we try to keep mm -hmm. population of yeah. donkey in country and we mm -hmm. you know what we're trying to do is we're trying to work with other organizations we work mm -hmm. with the tikibani trust in debt mm -hmm. and we work with a, a small um not-for-profit organization called vodat mm -hmm. in the bahera birchinoff bridge area yeah um mm -hmm. where we've trained the guys they come here and they do the they learn how to make the harnesses mm -hmm. then they go back and teach the villagers. Yeah, yeah. And that's that's what we'd like to do is to set up much more of these satellite mm -hmm. organisations where we can, you know, we can just kind of oversee and help. And um, but they're there on the ground doing the job. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. the more people that are doing it, the more donkeys are not going to get hurt by the yeah, harnesses. Yeah, 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 um, yeah. Our other our other aim is talking about vets. Is that we're mm -hmm. now looking into next year getting a a new graduate you see. Yeah. to come and work with us. Yes, um, you, yeah. mm -hmm. So, 
so that you know they're getting experience and the yeah. nice thing then would be when we go to do the workshops because yeah, yeah, yeah. we go to do the harness workshop mm -hmm, but we mm -hmm. end up doing a lot of yeah, veterinary yeah. work yeah, as well. Yes, correct, correct. Yeah. So it would be very good for him or yeah, her yeah, yeah. Um, and it would be great for, for yeah. the donkeys if we could actually yeah, yeah, manage yeah, to yeah, yeah. get that that situation funded correct, and yeah, get correct. somebody with us. Helen, thank you much for a very great job. God <laughs> bless you because you are doing really very great job. Yeah. And really, I ask my friend from United States for another country, if you are interested of this uh, very special animal rescue center, send for me a message. I can explain for you how to donate for this organization. We must help. We must keep population of donkey in Zimbabwe. Thank you very much.